Finally tonight, hidden no more. Tonight, history made. NASA naming their headquarters building in Washington, D.C. after Mary W. Jackson, NASA's first black woman engineer. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. Part of a small group of black women hired as mathematicians at NASA. She was known as one of the human computers at Langley, Jackson, on the far right. Her role portrayed in the film Hidden Figures by actress Janelle Monet. If you were a white man, would you wish to be an engineer? I wouldn't have to. I'd already be one. Jackson became the first black female engineer at NASA in 1958 after being granted special permission to attend class at the then segregated engineering school. I plan on being an engineer at NASA, but I can't do that without taking them classes at that all-white high school. And I can't change the color of my skin. So I have no choice but to be the first. She graduated and went on to lead programs that helped in the hiring and promotion of women at NASA. Today at NASA, her former colleague and fellow human computer, Christine Darden. She made a very special effort to meet these young aerospace engineers, to welcome them, to show them hospitality, and to give them advice. Mary Jackson's grandchildren remembering her too. My grandmother was an amazing woman. She paved the way for so many without us even knowing. Because she was a warrior, someone who wouldn't take no for an answer. Grandma was a very loving, caring, and feisty woman. She was always our hero. She was always our star. A star indeed. A hidden figure, now a celebrated one. Good night. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.